Harold. Yes. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you. Uh, yes. It's great to see you looking well and healthy. No, uh, thank you. <laughs> I understand uh, you were at, at one point in St Anne's Hospital, is that correct? Yes, I am. Yeah, still there. That's the hospital I remember. I was, I was born in St Anne's Hospital, actually. Yes. <laughs> and they're being looked after. <laughs> wow. So how are you doing in terms of state in now? Terms, in terms of state, I'm much better now. Um, I had the peaks and troughs all the time, but I'm more levelling out now, now, so th that's a good thing. So they'll let me home. <laughs> so what do you? What does Harold Graham do now with his life? What is he doing now? Harold Graham is like saying, I still go out to the gyms, um, boxing gyms, uh, so personal training, yep. stuff like that, yeah, after his speeches, but it's just more so looking after myself, okay. keeping myself in frame around, around the vicinity that my, where I live. Okay. Uh, I mean, if I don't look after myself, who else is going to look after you? Yeah. Absolutely. Um, what would be a life lesson for, as your boxing career you'd give to a young fighter going forward? Life lesson is like saying looking after yourself whilst you're boxing and respect that your, your health and health, health, health comes before wealth. And you've heard it so many times. Health before wealth. About your health, the wealth, the soul will tell you. You'll lose it. You don't want to lose it. Keep it with you. Health and wealth. Like keep, keep happy, be lucky, and l luck's got things to do with it. Like being lucky, being the right place at the right time, and that type of stuff. And you know, just stick, stick with something. And if you can, sorry, stick with one, two, or three things if you can, as long as you can look after yourself while you're doing them. Fantastic. Um, an old friend of ours, Julian Jackson, regular on the channel. Um, <laughs> sore memory, I'm sure. You were that moment close away from becoming a world champion. Um, what do you remember of that fight with Julian Jackson? Uh, <laughs> I remember actually. I remember waking up from it. And oh dear! What happened? Yeah, just a weird, weird. It hit me weird. I, said, it, it, I couldn't recollect it. I was thinking about it, and then I watched it on the TV, and I said, "No way!" And he's like, saying, "What a shot!" And it's like saying, "You would have knocked the horse out." It, and I was the horse. <laughs> <laughs> or a donkey. <laughs> um, video games and boxing. Do you play any video games? I don't, I don't actually. I mean, I'm not, a, I'm not one of those on the computers. I'm not a computer freak. Uh, sorry, guys. Yes. But I'm, <laughs> but I'm not on the computer. I'm not on the computer. So like Would you ever consider being part of a boxing <laughs> game? I'd be a, yeah, I'd, I'd try to get in a part of it. Yes, if I could. Yes, if you could, you would. It's work. Great stuff. Thank you so much, Al. Okay.